Good morning, everybody. This is John with Sim Racing Revolution, and it is Friday. It is week eight in our iRacing series. We're racing the advanced Mazda MX-5 Cup, and uh, we're at Mount Panorama today. This is going to be a doozy. Uh, not my favorite track. I always have issues on this track, so hopefully today, this morning, will go well. It is very early. It's 5.08. We're going to run the 5.15 race this morning, so wish me luck. We'll be right back for this week's race. Hi everybody, and we are back. So good morning, uh, or good day, or whatever time it is where you're watching, or you're gonna watch. Um, so here we are, we are at the Mount Panorama Circuit. It's still the practice session right now for another about four minutes. So I wanna go over a few things with you that are changing today. Well, not really they are changing, but almost changed. I was gonna to try to do this race in VR, um, but I couldn't really verify all the uh, overlays were gonna be working properly for the playback for you guys to be able to see. Uh, so I ended up not doing that this morning. Um, I will test that next week and next Friday, we'll try our first VR race in iRacing in this format and see how that goes. Um, I really wanted to try it today only because I think this course would lend itself well to the immersion of VR and to help me get around this course a little bit better because um, I'm only on one flat screen. So we'll see how this goes today. Um, I'm not expecting anything, you know, great to happen here, but you never know. I mean, we'll see how it goes. We're going to race. We're going to try to race conservatively as possible. Um, because I think a lot of folks are are going to underestimate this circuit and it's going to it could be a disaster. So we'll see how it goes, though. I mean, there's probably a lot of great rider drivers out there. So this is week eight. So we have participated in every week so far in this season of iRacing. So which means we will get race participation credits in our iRacing account, which is very cool. So after this race, week eight, after eight weeks of participating in a season, then you get race participation credits. I think it's like $5 in your iRacing account, which is which is nice. Um, so after two seasons, you almost have enough to get a car <laughs> or a track. So anyway, that's pretty nice. Um, let's see, the rest of the season, week nine, we're at Sebring. Week 10, we're at Monza. Week 11, we're at Red Bull Ring. And week 12, we are at the Circuit de Barcelona, Catalonia. So that will be the final race of the season in week 12. And uh, yeah, so far we haven't been really banging it up lately here, but, uh, and really today I have not practiced at all. Um, I practiced, like I said, just a little bit, like I think it might, might've been just one lap um, with VR this morning just to see how things were gonna work. And I couldn't really verify everything was gonna work right. So I didn't wanna do it this morning. So. Um, so we're back to 2D. I'm back to using SimHub because um, there's no point in SimHub for me unless, uh, yeah, I can see it and I can't see it in VR. So, uh, so let's, so we're going to get into this in a few seconds here. We're at 514 AM. So in one minute, we're going to be in race time. So, um, so once again, if you have not subscribed yet and you're watching and you do like this content of a really bad sim racer trying to do sim racing, uh, then go ahead and hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, and uh, hit the bell icon so you know when future episodes like this are coming out. Um, I do owe a couple episodes. I've been busy, so I haven't had a whole lot of time for videos, but um, next week I think we'll have a couple pumped out and uh, should be some good content coming up. More ACC stuff. Um, I do want to do a race room one too, because I think that game is really showing a lot of promise these days. So do definitely want to get in there and, and check that game out. Um, yeah, so let's get into racing here. Should be any moment now, and we'll be able to join our race session. So let's uh, grab my cup of coffee because we definitely need that before race time especially this early. I should call this like wake and race or something <laughs> just because it's like so early in the morning, but this is the best time for me. So, all right, here we are. We're going to start. Let's go in and race. And uh, let's try not to kill ourselves here. 
I'm going to put my headset on the other way so I can hear. And let's join this race. Of course, we didn't turn any laps there at all anyway, so no big deal. We're not going to save our replay for something we didn't really do. And my glasses are terrible once again. So let's see if we can clean that up before the race. I think that's better. Should be all right. Okay, so um, let's see. I think that's about it. So ACC content coming up. Yeah, I think that's about all we need to talk about. All right, so we got a three-minute practice session. So I think I'm going to go ahead and uh, just go ahead and <laughs> maybe practice a little bit here and see what we can do. Exit's clear. Push. I think like a 235 to 240 might be good on this um, as far as lap times go, but I can't be real sure if that's really good or bad. I think that's a pretty decent time though. Oh, and you will notice I did turn off the race lines for this as well. I think that might have been screwing me up a little bit, so... The track temperature is increasing. It's now 101 Fahrenheit. Wow, that was it already? And that is a really bad spot to put that flag. <laughs> I couldn't see anything. I don't know if you guys could see that or not. All right, we're in our qualifying. Uh, not sure, man. Let's do it. You're all clear. Stay behind the line. Okay, Johnny. We've got two laps to get the job done, mate. Okay, we only have eight minutes to qualify here, so um, we're going to be lucky if we get two full laps in here, probably. We should be able to get at least, well, we're going to have our outlap here, which is so really three laps um, to get her done, so we'll see what happens here. And that didn't start off well. Like I said, I should have practiced. The track temperature's rising. It's now 99 Fahrenheit. Ooh. We 
should be able to take this, I think. Full speed. Not this part. Yeah. We're off track there. Okay, we're gonna have to slow down on that one. I didn't know what I'd be able to get away with, honestly, so... So the one race results I saw for earlier this morning, almost half of the field uh, bailed <laughs> on the race. I don't know if they were just you know, like destroyed cars and were out of the race or what, but... This is our first real lap, so let's see how we do here. could probably take that like going full speed in third up that hill I don't know I don't trust it don't really trust this car I don't think this lap's going to get us anywhere, but we're trying to race clean laps here, so we're taking this as kind of our practice session as well. You know, this one I was okay, I think. Yeah. This one here, we need to gear way down. Not sure how to approach that one yet. Probably not the way, but. Eighth place. That lap time was 246.64. Yeah, not where we want to be. Yeah. 246. We want to get down to like 240. I don't think we're going to be able to do it. Not without more practice.
Hey, we're definitely making up some time here. Um, still, we're not where we want to be, obviously, but uh, we're making it around the track without without incident so far. Wow, except for that first lap. That's the end of the session. Tenth position. Oh, see, couldn't even get through the eight lap qualifying. So, you know. I don't know how we're going to do here. Let's see what the results were just out of curiosity here. 234s, 235s, 241, 246. Yeah. This is not going to end well. I know it. Oh, my gosh. What did I get myself into this morning? But this is a race. Win, lose, draw, get out of the race. This is going to be the one that you guys watch. Um... I am not going to redo this video or redo this race. We are racing to the finish, regardless of what it takes. Okay. <clears throat> Wish me luck, everybody. See how this goes. And once again, please subscribe if you like watching bad sim racers. And uh, yeah, mash that like button. We're learning, guys. This is how this is how we we roll here. Uh, so everybody behind me has not qualified. Um, which is maybe a problem because they're probably they could be really good and they just don't want to qualify because they want to start in the back and fight their way forward. Um, or they just don't care, you know, they just want to hang back in the race and uh, not cause any issues. So that could be as well. So we shall see how this one goes. Uh, but everybody is getting into the into the ready. Uh, look at Nick Martin. Uh, he's on seventh position here, and uh, he's an A rating at a 4.2. Um, so that's pretty good. I guess A class and a 4.2 rating. I guess I should say it that way. So yeah, but he is only a one, something like that. Is that right? I don't even know. No, that's where he is in front of me. All right, here we go, guys. Race time. All right, Johnny, get ready. Go! Looks like P1 has gone off in Hell Corner. I don't know how they know that. Car on your left. You're clear left. I might need to get around this guy, maybe. I don't know. I'll definitely have some uh, latency issues going on with that guy.
There's an incident in the chase. It looks like road bent. Yellow flag, caution. Lead car's pitting. Left side. Clear on the left side. Okay, Johnny, there's a car exit in the pit. Heads up. P8. We're gonna let this guy go, butt go by. They're on your right. Wow, somebody went off back there. I guess I should say that last race I looked up earlier. Had a lot of folks that were uh, disconnected, I guess, uh, during the race. So, probably means they wrecked. Hey, well, we're not doing too shabby. We're all right. So far, so good.
So we started P10. Okay, so, yeah, I'm not going to win this race, I know that, but I want to stay in the race, so we're going to race a good race, I know I'm not practiced enough on this track, so I'm going to play this smart, and just try to finish this in one piece. Rodriguez behind is now 1.0. P12. The track temps increasing. It's now 102 Fahrenheit. Careful, car on your right. Clear on your right. Hmm. Okay. Maybe that'll be it for us.
far right. Still there. All clear on the right. <laughs> Yeah, I think we're doing okay here. is now 0.6. We've had a cut warning. Keep it tidy, please, Johnny. Left side. Hold your line. You're clear left. All right, we're in the clear. <laughs> P13. Now we can just race for a while anyway, it'd be good. I'm gonna try to stick close to this guy.
Sector 1 is 2.5 seconds off the pace. Sector 2 is 4.3 off the pace. Sector 3 is 2.2 off the pace. Yeah, we definitely need help on this track. See, this is not my favorite track, though. I'm very scared of that upper part of the track, that higher elevation where you're going down there. It's just, uh... I just don't like it. 15 minutes left. Okay, Johnny, double chances here. Let's make sure we can take them. The track temperature is decreasing. It's now 94 Fahrenheit. Yeah, we really screwed up that turn. Hey. Ay ay ay. Watch where I'm going. If I get off on the dirt in here, like I was surprised when I made it through that first uh or that what was that, the practice lap or whatever. And then that one after that too when I ran off the road up here. That's okay. So hopefully our I rating might go up a little bit after this, um, or our safety rating, I mean. Okay, we're on lap nine of about 13. We're probably the slowest car on the track, just saying.
Okay, Johnny, 10 minutes to go. That's 10 minutes left. Don't think about the lap times. Just hit each and every apex. Okay, so we got about three to four laps to go here. I think uh, four laps, I'm thinking, is probably what we're going to have. That's about as fast as I know how to go through that part. Gosh, I do not know how to navigate that turn. It's tough, man. It is tough. Maybe I need to look into like custom setups or something. I don't know. Okay, so we're on lap 11 now. Next lap will be 12. Uh, yeah, I think uh, 14 probably, I think. OK, 
Okay, Johnny. Five minutes to go. Five minutes left. P12. I'd say the qualifying was probably just about right there. Um, you know, kind of based on where I ended up. Push now, the guy behind is catching. Alright Johnny, you've got half your fuel left. Okay, I think we're pushing our last lap here. I think we're in P10 now. Maybe we're starting to figure out that turn after uh, only 12 laps. Okay, we're on lap 13 right now, and uh, we don't have the white flag yet, so I'm guessing this lap and one more. Carol is now leading.
Now we're in ninth position now. Everybody must be bailing or something. Okay, one more lap. Let's make it through clean. White flag, one more to go. That's the fastest lap. Sector two is 3.8 seconds off the pace. Who's this guy? Oh, he must have been in the pit. So he came out right before. Wow, that thing is right in my line of sight. The gap in front has increased. It's now about 9.6 seconds. It's on the last car coming in. It's still running. That's two minutes left. Two minutes. Position. Okay, it's over. All right, that's it. And that is all that she wrote for that one. Um, our car doesn't look too smashed. It does a little bit. We lost a mirror. That's okay. We did hit that wall there, and that's the only thing that we hit, which really wasn't too bad um, compared to previous races where we were just like, just crazy bad um so anyway this race is over let's go ahead and quit out of here and let's save our replay okay so let's go and check out our race results since they are ready and we can go in and check them out so let's do it our safety rating went up to a plus 0.15 our i rating went up one Wow, look at that. Ah, oh, I need the coffee. Okay, so this was good. I'm very happy with this. Um, you know, even though we could have done a little bit better, um, we still came in 10th position, which wasn't bad. Um, although our race times were pretty crappy. Uh, our best lap time was a 241.9. 
our average lap time was a 244.9. So about three seconds difference between our average and our best lap, which isn't terrible, but um, it's not as consistent as I would have liked. Um, and of course, everybody after us, uh, you know, kind of struggled a bit there because there were 20 people in the race, 10 people, um, well, actually a few bailed out. There were some that were running um, to the end of the race, but uh, yeah, this uh, 235 and, you know, average lap time of a 236, uh, that's a pretty darn good um, lap time on here, I think. So that's that's pretty awesome. I mean, he's a very good driver there. Uh, no incidents either. I had four incident points um, for hitting that wall, most likely. Um, but we did get 33 championship points, which is good. And um, our best lap was lap 13. Go figure. Uh, right. And I think they called us out on that. That was our best lap was, you know, the one where we weren't really caring a whole lot about. Uh, but we did complete all laps. Very happy about that. And uh, yeah, there you go. So we will be back right after this and uh, we'll wrap this whole thing up. Okay, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I thought it was a good race. Uh, we stayed out of any bad incidents or collisions or anything like that other than hitting the wall, which was our own fault. Um, but we didn't do any lasting damage to the car, which was great. And we were able to finish the race with no issues. Um, I, you know, I do need to improve. I know that. But I think I, this was a great step today, I think, in that I was able to kind of navigate the track, even though I hate this track and I was very nervous going into it, um, figured let's, let's do it, let's get it done and see how we do. Um, we weren't the best in, in the race, but um, we didn't need to be really, we just needed to finish and do well. And we did. And that reflected in our I rating and all that. So, um, yeah, so I had a good time. I thought it was a good race. So thanks a lot for watching, everybody. I really appreciate it. Um, this was week eight. Next week, if I grab my little sheet here. Next week, we are at Sebring. So that should be a much better, uh, <laughs> maybe a much better race. We'll see how that goes. Uh, but next week is week nine. We're going to be at Sebring. Um, we are you know, basically two thirds of the way done with this season. And uh, boy, what a season it's been too. It's been a lot of fun. Um, some highs, some lows, some heartache, everything. So all in all, pretty decent. So uh, thanks guys. Thanks for watching. Please hit that subscribe button and mash that like button. Take care guys. This is John of Sim Racing Revolution. Until next time, keep sim racing. Bye-bye.